I had a dream that the annoying orange said the N-word. Oh, so we're just starting off real strong, aren't we? Okay. I need to apologize. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, man. Also, side note. The annoying orange does feel like some sort of creation from another universe, doesn't it? I mean, that first video was weird and funny and we all thought it was crazy and look where we are now. Oh my goodness gracious me, where in the world am I? It seems I'm in someone's dreams. I wonder what kind of weird ass memes people dream about. Why don't we figure that out together? Just the two of us, you and me, James, dozed off at school once and saw this image for a split second. Choose a difficulty. British? Extra British. Yeah, you must have been absolutely whacked out. What in the world could this possibly mean? None of it makes any sense to me, but I like it. Hey, look at me, I'm British. Wow, epic fail. Woke up with this image in my head. I have no idea what the correct Japan would have been. Why is it downloading the wrong Japan? Yeah, I'm curious too. That looks like the regular old Japan to me. But then again, what do I know? I've never even been there yet. Maybe MK will send me over there on like a retreat to find the best memes the world has ever seen. <laughs> That's what we'll do. We'll do memes around the world. They'll send me on location to like eight different countries, and by the end, I'll have been beaten half to death. It doesn't matter. Dreamt that there was a TikTok trend where kids would ask their parents to read the word Avengers, and they'd always say Aveners, and it became the biggest trending discussion online. <laughs> Why, when, why Jet Xers pronounce Avengers a Wiener? What the hell does that mean? <laughs> this one's pretty good. Thank you, Tom. I'm really, really glad that he was there to educate us along the way. That's, I like this one. I really like this one. <laughs> it's so harmless and weird. And yeah, that would become the biggest discussion of all time, would it not? It was like for a very, very brief moment in time when people thought Benedict Cucumber Batch absolutely could not pronounce penguins. Penguin. Penguins. I saw this in my dream. How about you stop being a sussy baka and start being a sustainable baka? <laughs> Do it for Mother Earth, dude. Hell, do it for Brother Earth. It doesn't matter. Do it for somebody, dude. Live for something. Dreamed up this meme today, and, uh, yeah, I don't get it either. Groomer. Haha, <laughs> you're so smart for your age and mature, too. Versus Broomer. Holy fuck, I love sweeping. <laughs> I'm going with a Broomer every single time. Every single time, okay? I had a dream I won the Nobel Prize for writing a BuzzFeed article that got a hundred billion hits about Ryan Gosling's pasta lookalikes. Can you imagine, though, a Nobel Prize for writing a gossip article? Ten bowls of mac and cheese that look just like Ryan Gosling. And literally, the first comparison you have looks nothing like Ryan Gosling. Are you even trying with this fake BuzzFeed article? I don't think you are, dude. Saw a meme in one of my dreams last night that had Confucius, but he was a cat boy, and it said, catnip got me acting unwise. Ah, as Confucius say, catnip will sometimes get you acting unwise, I guess. Deadpool is Deadpool no matter where he is. Had an interesting dream last night that I was the director of Deadpool 3. I asked Ryan Reynolds to do one of those fourth wall breaks, and he told me, you're dreaming, kid. It's time to wake up. And right after he finished talking, my school alarm went off. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds true to Deadpool's character, okay? Time to wake up! Rise and shine, Stubby! Or true to Ryan Reynolds. You know, they're the same damn person anyway. So what does it really matter? I saw this diagram in a dream and felt the need to introduce it to the waking world. No legs, no house. House, no legs. Legs and house. Legs, no house. Ah, legs, no house. It's me. There was a full story involving this scenario, but I forgot what it was. Can't wait to check out the results of my disinterest potion. Actually, never mind. I don't really care anymore. <laughs> okay, this one's just good. Can we get more goofy little comic strips like this on the internet and not ones that just make me incredibly upset? I'm starting to think some of you are just fully consciously coming up with memes and then saying you saw it in a dream so that you can post it here. I mean, that would make sense. I I've, I've known many people in my life who claim I had this crazy dream, and then it's... No, you didn't dream that. Come on. I know you did not dream that Keanu Reeves proposed to you. No, no, no. 
Not how that works, okay? He probably showed up and went, hey dude, and then disappeared, or you got Deadpooled like that last person, but some of them are clearly made up. I've, I've had some crazy dreams, I've heard of people having some crazy dreams, but sometimes people try to make them so much crazier than they were. Dude, it's a dream! I had a dream that McDonald's had a big ad campaign that just said, we have it, in black cryptic writing. So I went to a drive-thru and said, I saw the sign, can I have it? And the speaker was silent for a solid 10 seconds before saying, do you think you're ready? In my voice, and I screamed and drove away. See, part of this feels like they're not making it up, you know, McDonald's having we have it in black cryptic writing, but then you got the details of the speaker was silent for a solid 10 seconds before like, what? Well, I see, the most vivid dreams I've ever had, I remember one or two things about, ever in my life. I know we're all different, but that's really, really good memory on a dream. And aren't dreams notorious for being super hard to remember the details of? This briefly flashed in my mind as I drifted off to sleep. I can fix her. My brother in Christ, she stabbed you in the stomach. So, what's one mortal wound? I can sustain at least a couple of those. I had a dream, and you had a dream? I had a dream. <laughs> and one part of it was that the rock ratioed a random transphobe on Twitter really hard. <laughs> What's the name of this country again? The women from here are all so damn hot. Those are not men. Ratio. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> this flashed before my eyes, right before falling asleep. Why? How would that flash before your eyes? Uh so wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You didn't dream this at all then. Right before you fell asleep, you just thought of random combination and posted it. No, no, get, get the hell out of here, dude. These are supposed to come from dreams, you liar. I dreamt that this was in the comic section of my local newspaper. Have you seen the face of God? No, no, I haven't. Garfield's had his time. It's my time now. You will weep at the sight of it. Probably. Yeah. I mean, angels have to conceal their true physical appearances because we'll can explode if we really see them, right? I woke up, but I often dream about waking up. So I was suspicious as to if I was actually awake or still dreaming. Naturally, I googled if I was dreaming or not. I got this result and then I woke up for real. Am I dreaming? Yes. <laughs> See, that, I don't even know what to make of that. I just don't know what to make of that one, man. Some of them are just, that one's kind of scary to me. That one freaks me out. I had a dream that instead of smartphones, we carried around smart kitchen knives. Well, I mean, that'd be better for self-defense. I can't really use my iPhone to stab a guy who's assaulting me or something like that, you know? And by assaulting me, I mean he's trying to assault me with his smart knife, his eye knife, if you will. Um, so I'm not just stabbing a dude because he pushed me or something like that. I'm not, I'm not that type of guy. Had a dream where the B in LGBT was replaced with British, and the only way for bisexuals to have rights was to find islands to expand the British maritime borders. You want rights? Bring me three islands. Wow. Wow. I don't know if this counts, but this flashed in my head during a mental breakdown at school. Movie leaks. <laughs> this character dies. No. Leaks movie. I had just got a new car. Want to take it for a spin? Sure thing, but first, I gotta take a leak. Please don't give the internet more ideas. Where would we be without him? I had a dream that I googled a question, and this is what it gave me. Who created the world? In 1979, the planet Earth was created by Luigi from nothing other than a few grapes. So not from nothing then. Back when I was still questioning my sexuality, I had a dream where Mario jumped out of a pipe, looked me in the eyes, and called me a boy-loving gay ass, and then I woke up drenched in sweat. See, I don't believe that one. I don't believe that Mario popped out of a pipe and called you a boy-loving gay ass, and then, no, uh-uh. Mario would never do that, okay? Do you even know who Mario is? I don't think you do, dude. All I remember from my dream last night is Joe Biden saying this. Stop updating Microsoft. It's my turn. Uh, it feels like something he would say for sure, though. I don't know why, it just does feel like that. Oh, what the hell? The game coming to the Wii in like two seconds. I had a dream where I went to Target, went to the DVD and game section, and saw a Wii game called, Oh, what the fuck, with this picture on the cover. Well, like, did you try it out? I'm sorry if I saw that game. I don't care what the price is. I'm going to pay it. I want to know what's on that disc. My brain came up with this during the scariest power nap of my life. The paramedics staring at my lifeless body. Why are they so happy? Is it because they don't really have to do as much work? They just have to clean up the mess and take you to a morgue? Why are they so happy? Just found this sub and thought about a very old meme from a dream like 
eight months ago. Pee color chart. Really have to see a doctor. See a doctor. You need the drink more. More water. Drink more water. What? Yeah, I I think what also means you need to see a doctor. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Had a dream several months ago where I got this pop-up and ended up making it a real program. Hey, it's a Peter alert. Why are you using Windows 95 or 98 or whatever? What are you doing over there? Pirates doxing each other. I'm completely serious. I had a dream where Twitter was dominated by pirates and people would dox each other by using ship longitude and latitude. Your crew smells of bilge, matey. <laughs> I think... I think on Pirate Day, we should all commit to this bit. Every single one of us should suddenly be pirate-themed for the day, talk like pirates, and pretend to dox each other with the coordinates. I just remembered that I saw this tweet on my phone in my dream last night. I thought I'd remake it and post it here. We are proud to announce our partnership with McDonald's. We're going to be turning human souls into cows, then turn them into chicken nuggets. Stop, you can't do that. It's unethical and makes it so their souls don't go to heaven because they're destroyed. Destroyed. Your content sucks plus ratio. I feel like the Pope would actually do that. He would ratio dream, I guess. I had a dream where Miss Frizzle went with me to a pride parade. She would jog around and encourage people to celebrate pride and have fun. You know what? Miss Frizzle would absolutely be down as hell to make sure that you are the real, true you and nothing else. Miss Frizzle may have been a psychopath that put her students in danger on the daily, but she ain't no bigot. A couple nights ago, I dreamt that Joe Biden tried to end racism by opening an indoor water park. My fellow Americans, racism is no more. Hold on. Now wait just a minute. This could work. Look, I'm not saying it's a foolproof plan, but what I am saying is we need something right now. And I think a city-sized indoor water park could finally solve this racism crisis that we've been dealing with throughout our entire history. Dreams show me the vilest concepts. This was a few nights ago, and I can't stop thinking about it. DJ and guy guy in electric chair. Wait a minute, is the chair gonna turn on when he hits the drop? That's, that's what's gonna happen, right? Roan nouns? I had a dream that Roblox added pronouns to the website with their new Ronouns update. That's the most cursed goddamn sh that you could have said. I don't know why. It just is. Ronouns? People are gonna start branding pronouns and making my games more woke? You can't do this to me, man. Thought of this right before I woke up. How can I be shapist if I have a circular friend? <laughs> Whoa, whoa, what is happening here, man? This might just be the single most genius Reddit post of all time. I just had the weirdest freaking dream. This new sh started trending where people would ask if you wanted to be their Venny. And whenever you asked what the hell Venny meant, they just sent you this horribly compressed spring trap gif, 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 with the caption, the bee, and blocked you. Did you create a version of this gif? Do you have that? Because I really want to start this trend myself personally. I do believe that the human race is owed this one, CEO of chicken. This came to me in a dream. I wish everyone was addicted to crack. Timmy, what the fuck? <laughs> no, no, really, Timmy, what is your actual problem? You know, Timmy, I really sympathize with you, dude. I really do. Your parents are neglectful psychopaths, for sure, that don't seem to really like you or care about your existence, per se, but that does not mean that you get to take that frustration out on every other human being, or possibly animal. Maybe they're included in everyone in his mind. I don't know. Does this not go against, like, the fairy code or something like that? Is Cosmo allowed to grant this wish? Knowing Cosmo, he would anyway. He would not be the one to stop this. He would not actually be the one to ask, yo, Timmy, what's your problem? It would probably be Wanda in this case, not Cosmo. It I digress. I'm getting a little bit too deep and philosophical about what amounts to a singular funny haha -ha gag. Someone said April has the same energy as a towel. I'm gone. Wait, hold on. They might be onto something there. I'm thinking about it. I'm really trying to envision it. And you might actually be kind of right. I don't know how to explain it, though. And then again, you don't really have to explain vibes or feelings necessarily. Sometimes they're just there. I dreamt I saw this meme while scrolling through Twitter. We've got Coke and Pepsi. They're crying. But then there's my Giga Chad friend in the middle mixing the two together. You know, I think I did try to mix the two together once. Just tasted like crap, you know? I mean, say what you will about Pepsi or Coke, but just mixing those two flavors together ain't gonna cut it. 
that dog ain't gonna hunt. Very unwise indeed. I literally had a nightmare that everyone on the internet was doing something called wise posting, and I just couldn't get it right. And so people would bombard my replies with the sentence, hmm, no, very unwise. <laughs> okay, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, this one, I'm taking it. I am taking it, and I am going to do my best to use it, not to cause a trend, but I'm just, I'm gonna use it to the best of my ability. I salute you, material girl. I had a dream that Vin Diesel was my mailbox. I mean, like, it was just him from the waist up, attached to a pole in the ground. He handed me my mail and said, looks like you got some bills today. Would be nicer if they were dollar bills, you know? And then he chuckled to himself at the rest of the dream. I've included an image that best represents what I saw in my dream. The only differences were Vin Diesel had a huge goofy smile on his face, and his arms were folded across his chest. So he, he was kind of sitting like a genie. He was looking like a big happy... No, wait a minute. You were probably thinking of the cover of Kazam. Yeah, so he looked like Shaq on the cover of Kazam, and he was your mailbox. This one I thoroughly believe. Out of all of them, this feels the most believable to me, and I cannot tell you why. I had a dream the sky was on fire, and when I checked the weather app on my phone, it just said wrath. See, that is how the apocalypse should occur. God has to know that by this point, we really put ourselves really into our own graves with these um, magical info bricks that we carry around. If he's smart, or if she's smart, that's the way to go. Just give us ping notifications. Like, hey, it's happening, by the way, guys. Lol, yeet yeet, or something like that. I don't know. God definitely would not understand memes at all in any way. You know I'm right on that.